Good afternoon everyone, it's Rachel here and following on from um, altering this book, I'll probably keep the two videos separately. I'm going to do my um, Marguerite Miller challenge and I'm going to just start right here on the inside cover. And we are up to uh, CW Planner 18, a name, an animal, a travel item, oh, a travel item. Hmm. I don't have a travel item. I might have to stop and go and get one in a minute. Um, something black and white. Something written or drawn with your non-dominant hand. A triangle is the bonus. So for my animal, I'm going to do... That's a rabbit. That's a mouse. So this cute image is from the uh, Foxwood Treasure. And I bought it to use it. So I'm not going to hoard it. So what I do with books is if I um, if I, I really love a book, I will buy, if they're not too expensive, of course, um, I will buy two, one to keep and one to use. So um, but I love these children's illustrations. So we'll put that one in and that's decided. Okay, then a name. Well, I can have plenty of names. Here's a name. Anton Dessel, and that's a real piece of ephemera. And um, and then black and white. Well, this is kind of black and white. And then this is black and white. Uh, and that, that was black and white, but it's um, aged now, so it's gone a bit yellow. I probably pulled out way too much um, stuff, but anyway. And that would have been black and white as well. But anyway, I don't know. I don't know. Um, yeah, so black and white, and here's another name. So I don't know, I've got to try and get this all to work. Let me see. Well, this was black and white, but that's new, I don't want to use that. Uh, this is black and white, it's like a it's not white, white, but it was. So let's use a piece of super old book page somewhere, okay? I've got to get the, the glue off. So how is everybody today? Hope you're well. I'm super excited because we are going to Florence for a night to see our friends who lived there when we were there. And I might tear, I'm going to tear this one down so it fits onto one page. Just a sec. So, yep, uh, Steph's uni friend and his wife and, and, and we all, you know, hung out together when I used to live there in the 90s. Okay, and now let's see, could put this one maybe over here. I do want to get a bit of colour in here. Just working it out. Yep, I think I quite kind of like that. I like that page, so let's glue that down. I'll use this as my first glue page. Oh, just a minute. Got something lumpy under there. So I think this book turned out pretty well. Like, you know, I did it. Uh, the, uh, oh, the other one, I yes, that way I made that other one into a journal that I did, didn't I? So this one is the first one that I've done properly that I kept myself. The other ones weren't done properly. The other ones you've seen me work in before. Okay, I think I'm going to put those there. I might just tear this down a little, teeny, just the edge off. Not with this ruler, the other ruler. Where's the other ruler? Okay, put that there. I like all the different fonts, like the typewriter and the handwritten and the old font. I like mixing it all up. Put that there. 
and then I was going to put this one. Maybe I'll change direction. Was it that one? It was going to be that one. But I'm going to also tear this, just this edge. Getting some super hot weather here. We're going to be going up to 39 degrees on the weekend, which is going to be terrible. Um, which is about 100, I think, Fahrenheit. I looked it up. So that's pretty hot for us. I know there are places in the States that have that on a regular basis. I don't know how you cope, guys. I really don't. But the humidity hasn't set in yet, touch wood, so that always helps. And I am going to glue this in. I'm going to lock this in. Now I could put it up there and have this down here somewhere. Or I could have it's probably much of a muchness, isn't it? Yes, it is. Okay, so I'll put that on so starting with my sort of neutral background oops if it's a really short video i will add it to the other one no i won't because i want to keep my marguerite separate oh my goodness the worst gluer ever the worst um no i want to keep them separately so we'll do two separate videos they might be two short videos I say that, don't I? And then I take forever to do this. There's something that will stop me, that will slow me down in my tracks. Stop me in my tracks. I'm just going to grab my towel to get the glue off my hands. Okay, and I'm going to put my cute little image here. I love that. Mm -hmm. Oh, I think I like it more up there. I do, I like it more up there, you see, this is what happens. I'm going to put it up there, guys. And then I'll have to work something out for the other page. Oh, I need my luggage tag. I wanted to go and print out because I don't think I've got one printed from the Graphics Fairy, a luggage tag because it's a luggage, it's a travel item. What else could be a travel item? I guess a ticket, but I, I don't think I've got any tickets floating around. I was thinking I might like that. Maybe I won't use that. That was kind of, that was black and white too, if you see. I thought that could be interesting. I kind of like it down there. Um... So I do need a luggage ticket. Ow! Oh, oh, sorry. I just whacked my elbow. Sorry, guys. Whacked it. Got this piece. Oh, I think a piece of this. I just I just um had some paint to finish off. And I just painted it. I think I'm going to put that on there. I think this is going to be good. Oh, I whacked my elbow. Now I'm having a hot flurry. Oh my goodness. It was and it did it did hurt, I will say that. Yep, 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 yep. This is good. I'll tell you why. Those colours go well together. So let's glue this on. Yep, a hot flurry is definitely happening. I feel like I need some ice. Whew, and my glue's melting. I mean and it's not that unbearable in here, it's just hurting hitting my elbow made me um, feel hot which is just bizarre okay and I think I drew that with my with my non-dominant hand too but anyway we'll do something on camera I don't know I just keep all of that and just go like this Okay. Oh, it's got sparkles on it because Lulu used my paintbrush um, with sparkles. Oh, I like that. I'm going to put that there. I'm not even going to think about it. Just going to do it. Mm. 
Okay. Still need to get a travel item. We've got a name. I'm going to put this one down here, I think. Yes, I am. Got a travel. And we need to get a travel item. Transport. Ha <laughs> ha. Something that transport. It's a transport document. Does that does that count? A transport document? It's probably a um yeah, transport document. Um I guess that counts. It's a travel item. Wouldn't be a regular travel travel item for most of us, but it is for the truck. Yep, those sparkles are ingrained into the the paint. I do have this little piece here. No, too big, too many bits. Okay. Now, um, okay, I will need a place to write on. I still need to go and get my travel item, and I'm thinking I will go and get a luggage, print out a luggage tag from the Graphics Ferry, but I'm wondering. What do I have here? Are any of these travel ones? I don't think so. Daily play, vintage note, daily schedule. No, they're all organisational ones. The Mo cards. I just want to see what other ones I've got in my box here. If I have any other Mo cards that might be of any help whatsoever to me. No. Oh, here we go. Here's lots to do list. We need to get into here. I haven't done this this week, have I? It was just a piece of packaging cut in a tag shape. Oh, here we go. What's this? No, there's no animals on there. That was Edith Holden. I thought there might be some animals on there as an extra bonus. Um, postcard. I wonder if a postcard counts as a travel item. I don't know. To do this, oh, these were the um, the papery ones. Daily schedule, schedule, schedule. No travel things. Library card, vintage note. Okay. And what's in here? Put all these things. They're not either. They're cute. This could, this one could work maybe to write my prompts in. There's nothing travelish in there. There's a bird. Oh, that would be good for the prompts as well. So these just came off AliExpress. I don't even know what I looked for. I They just recommend things. I don't think I even looked for anything. They just um, recommend things. When you when you save something, they recommend other stuff. And that's what happened. That's how I found those. So that, and they come in it, this box and it's called Squid Ink. Oh, that's a funny one. Master Poseidon's Under the Sea something. Uh, and then here, Truce. There's no brand or anything like that on there. Let me just see if I've got those. That's those. I don't have any other travel items here. Pharmacy. No. Okay. So I'm going to pause the video and go and print out a... I'll, put, I'll print out a few because I can use them. And then I will be back. I didn't stop you. I'm having trouble stopping you today, just to say I'm back. I printed out a few things um, because I didn't want to waste, you know, just print one thing. So this is a um, bagage, so it's a, a luggage tag. So I'll just cut this one out. But I also, they also had a, um, on their website, they had a suitcase. So if I thought we'll put that in just to make sure I get it right. And then I was thinking of, this was the one I was thinking of, this um, original Czech Pacific Company 
baggage and that's a shipping thing as well so there's plenty of tags that's what I'm that's all I'm going to find for travel items so I'm going to cut them out and then I'm going to decide which one do I want to use I just printed them on regular copy paper because um, I'm gluing them in in a collage so I don't need them to be thick or anything like that although you know me I would just back them onto something on a piece of um, book page if I wanted to make it stronger as a tag it's not the best cutting in the world mm. let's do it again okay and I brought in this hole punch because it's bigger I think I need a bigger one Oh, it's not even going to be big enough. I have to cut some more out there. Or maybe I'll use, where is it? I've got a little mini one somewhere. It's white. Here it is. Maybe I'll use that one. It's a, no, that one's too big and it doesn't quite get there. Okay, so we'll just have to deal with that. Um, cut this one out. So actually I'm now thinking that these I might not use that um, because these will be good for writing my prompts on and I need to cut them out so that way I can decide which one I want Yes, I'm doing video. Oh, sorry. It's okay. Why? No, I'm scared to plug in the thing. What thing? The, the, the oh, why? Just plug it in. Oh, it wouldn't go in. She's making herself a um, a fruit juice. So that'll be the noise that you can hear. Do you want me to close the kitchen door? No. Because it's loud. It's okay, Lily. Okay. So I quite like these colours. I like that. And then I might use this one here. And can I write in there? Not really. Uh, maybe I'll do a a drawing there I could do a drawing up there here I could oh well I'm going to change my mind maybe I could put something like take that off put that there for writing Let me just think a minute. Now that's going to blend in. So I'm going to put the, I think I'll put the, the suitcase here somewhere. Up here. Put the suitcase there. I really did like these colours. Looks wonderful, Lulu. Can I show? Oh no. Okay. It looks no. The the blend is not the best. <laughs> Thank you, Lulu. I think I'll put those there. This is a tough one. You see, I I think I'm going really fast, and then I become stuck. Okay. I could have just cut the suitcase out and had less covering the background but I haven't I've, I've glued it now so too late too bad I think I'll put that there And then I 
might put my CW planner in this. Or do I want a different colour? I probably do need that there. I'm going to try and squeeze my little list in there. Let's see if I can do that. Let's just do that now. A name. Item. Theme black and white something written or drawn with. Oh, dear, I'm smudging. Two, three, four, five. Bonus, and I'm not doing the bonus today. A triangle. Sorry about the noise she's making. Okay. And then I need to put some sort of label where I can write, write CW Planner. one I like oh no it's a bit blendy decisions decisions they really are the worst Or a pop of red. Oh, I could put it there. No, I don't want it there. Yeah, maybe a pop of red. So I'm going to glue that there. And I'm going to write... Hashtag CW Planner eighteen and I'm not quite done yet. I've got to still do I'm gonna do like a random foliage up here with my non dominant hand. Okay. Oh, thank you, Lily. That's lovely. And I think I'll do Pretty. one up here as well. Just so it's, it goes together. And I'm just also thinking I'm going to find... Some sort of other little animal. Wait, let's just see here. I have some animal stamps as well. That could be cute. So we could have a variety of animal stamps. 
So let's see. First, let's start over here. Oh, this one's going to be good, I think. Do you want to put it here anywhere? Maybe over here. This is where we need some colour. Horsey. Mm. I'm just looking. Um, I know you can't see, but I need to keep you over here so that way I can. What is that? Oh, it's a bird. So I can see the colours, how they're going to go. Oh, here's a triangle. It's a triangle one. We need to put the triangle somewhere. There. Maybe. That way I've done that as well. I've got this beautiful stamp here. Something like that, I think. I think that's what I'll do. Like this one. No. That's too similar to the other one. Okay, I'm going to glue these in. I did get my bonus one done as well. There we go. I could have drawn triangles with my non-dominant hand. That could have worked as well. Was I putting that there? There we go. So we've got lots of animals. We've got butterflies, birds, um, porcupine um, or hedgehog, a mouse and a rabbit. I've um, got uh, luggage tags, suitcase for my travel item. Uh, something black and white. That was black and white. That was probably too. This was and that is under there. Um... Something written or drawn with your non-dominant hand here and here. And triangle. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, that's it. Okay, so there we go. There's the first one in this book. So I hope you enjoyed that. And you'll also see the, um, before. I'll post it before this one, the altering of the book. Um, yeah, so that's the first one done. So I'm very happy with that. And, um, and then we will continue on sometime next week with another Marguerite Miller challenge so thank you so much for watching and i hope you enjoyed that and i will see you again soon bye